Yeah. All right, thank you, Rachel. Now we're sending things over to Josh McBride, who's chatting with Real Housewives of Orange County star Shannon Bedore. Yeah, that's right. Sitting here with Real Housewife of Orange County, Shannon Bedore, who I've become fast friends with. <laughs> Shannon, let's talk. You went through this incredible transformation. How did it start by, by having a transformation, number one? And then number two, what inspired it? Well, you know, I, I kind of deteriorated and I didn't feel very good about myself, so I gained 40 pounds. But as I started to lose weight, then I would gain it back. So it was just this constant yo-yo and roller coaster. And then I woke up one day going, listen, like, things are good. You, I've realized that you can stand on your own two feet. You gotta just get this weight off. So I made that commitment and I lost the second 20 pounds. And so I've gained a little bit back now because I've been going out a little bit more than normal, but that's all good because I'm happy. You so. look fabulous. Thank Let's you. talk about your prepared food line. Okay. Um, this is a brand new venture for you? Well, I started it last year, uh, Real for Real Cuisine, because as I was trying to lose weight, I realized that you don't have to sacrifice flavor to eat a healthy meal. And so all the meals are under 500 calories. And uh, they all have some sort of sauce on it, so they're they're good. Shannon, we're in the, kind of the beginning right now of the season. What is to come for the rest of the season? Crazy fun with me. <laughs> Finally, year six. And if you are into the nasty drama, this season delivers there too. Who are you getting along with and not getting along with the most this season? Well, you know, I started off the season getting along with everyone, which was great. And there are a few events this year where everyone does get along and that's like rare. Um, that being said, I am close to Tamara, of course, and Vicky, Chase Amigas and Bronwyn, who is the new cast member. And I have a new fun friendship with Gina. Kelly and Emily were not so close. And there have been reports that you're uh, dating someone specifically uh, who I've had the pleasure of meeting, but you seem pretty happy. Yes, I'm extremely happy. That's all you're gonna say? Oh, that, don't, what, what? You can, tell, you can tell us about him, he's over there. Okay, you just, okay. John is very kind. Um, he's really one of the kindest people that I've ever met. And he is a great father, he has great family values, and he is a very thoughtful, passionate, patient person with me, and I'm very grateful that he's in my life. You obviously haven't filmed the reunion for this season. No. But how do you prepare to go into a reunion? Because a lot of drama ensues while you're there, probably before, is a little anxiety. Right. right. So I, I, as I started the show six years ago, I didn't realize that half of it is this interview commentary. So we're, we're actually still filming that. They're putting the episodes together as we go on. But I know what I've filmed. I don't know what all the other gals have been saying behind my back when they're in other groups or in their interview commentary. So, you know, you just kind of take, take note of as the season progresses, oh, why did she say that ab about me? I mean, last season, it was like, it was crazy, horrible for me. As I watched those interview commentaries, I felt that I was almost being attacked. So, you know, it, it can cause a lot of emotion. Thanks, Shannon. And you can make sure to check out Shannon Tuesdays on Bravo, of course, in Real Housewives of Orange County. Thanks so much for stopping by. Hit the subscribe button to stay in the loop on the latest celebrity and entertainment news and check out celebritypage.com for more Hollywood headlines.